fam. I was getting ready to uh, record this video and um, I thought I'd just come on here and say I lost the footage of the messy part of the room. So I don't have anything for you to compare, but if you watch some of my other videos, you've seen the background before and you've seen it be a hot mess. Um, so with that said, um, enjoy <laughs> this mini, like, um, what do I want to tour? I guess. I don't know. Well, you really want to call it, but um, it is what it is. So I lost it and I don't know what happened to it. Um, yeah, I know I got my phone services switched over. I don't know if I've lost some info or whatever. I don't know what's going on, but um, yeah, and um, let's get into the video. So, hey fam, how y'all doing? It's been a minute. Your girl been busy. Um, yesterday, um, I went to the dentist, so I could not talk to you guys because I couldn't talk yesterday because my mouth looked like, because they numb, you know how they do with the anesthesia and everything like that. But, um, I wanted to come back and show you guys what I've done with my slash office craft room, um, home gym. <laughs> and whatever else I want it to be. Okay, so I'm going to show you what's going on. Oh, what they did with my teeth yesterday. They cleaned them and then they filled them. And then we made the uh, appointment for um, my impressions. So I go back on the 23rd to get my impressions. Um, as you know, I had told you guys earlier. So here's a little update before we go into um, the revamp of the room, which I'm not totally like finished with yet but um this is just a little bit of a preview of what i'm doing um uh, but yeah back to the dentist um yeah i had went to another dentist office and didn't like the way they were handling or treating me so uh yeah and they took some of my teeth out <laughs> they took a lot of my teeth out um didn't like that so i left that uh, dental service and went to another one and now i am getting my uh implants permanent implants put in and my upper and lowers. Okay, so yes, I still my smile. Mm -hmm. So far, it's still good. <laughs> I had one cavity. Would you believe it? I had a cavity. But anyway, um, that's the story of the dental stuff. So let's get into the um the video, y'all. Y'all don't want to hear about all that. But I hope y'all doing well. Give me a hug. Mm -hmm. Hope y'all doing good today. Happy Tuesday to everybody out there in the YouTube world. Um, okay, fam. So here we go. Let me turn y'all around. Okay. This is in entering my room and here's one project that I still have to do. Well, that I'm going to be doing, and I don't know if I'm going to be keeping them or giving them away, but these are some nice stands. So y'all get the preview of what the before look, how, you know, they were given to me. So I'm going to redo them. And I'm going to show y'all how I get that done. There's my paint pan, my sanding brushes and stuff like that. And, um, yeah, so as you walk into this uh, bedroom, which is a bedroom, and as you saw in the previous clip, it was a hot mess. And I'm always saying don't look in the background because it's a hot mess or whatever have you. And now I've finally got some organization to the room. I am not completely done with it yet. Um, I have a lot more that I still want to do like um, steam those chair covers. <laughs> but as you walk in, um, you see my ring light and my uh, rack for my backdrops once I start using backdrops, um, my tripod. And then you come over to this way. Let me scan y'all slowly back over here So as I go. Okay. So over here, right here, y'all, all this stuff is supplies that I have for my DIY stuff. Okay, um, I have not really got it organized the way I want it, but it is organized to uh, where I can find things now. Plus, the closet here is full with a whole lot more stuff that I need to get organized that closet as well. That's a whole nother video. But, um, yep, I have my home gym in here, so I'm going to turn around here. Let y'all see. This is what I call my home gym. I have my stepper. I have my weights. 
and stuff that I use to work out with. I'm going to be putting up, you see that shelf right there, and that's probably where I'm going to be putting my stretch bands and stuff like that that I have. I installed this mirror so that I can see myself work out. Um, and then also here's my ab lounger, and I have been using that. So um, over here, you see in this corner here, my craft table and chair. And then on this um, shelf, bookshelf that I painted white, it was brown, is some supplies of stuff that I use. My um, back cloth that will be coming out real soon to do those um, nightstands with. Um, just, you know, tools and stuff. And in here, I'm just, I don't know if y'all want me to open all this stuff up, but here I have all my like Dollar Tree items that I use. Glitter and bling in there. Um... Extra stuff in here. Okay. Um, picture frames and mirrors and all kind of stuff in this drawer. Um, up here I have all my glue sticks, my glues, and whatever else. Miscellaneous stuff. Like I said, it's not really organized, organized. But it is, um, you know, and this is all my bling. Bling wrap, bling whatever bling you could have. <laughs> <laughs> and also down here is all my tapes and sticks and whatever else I decide to use for DIYs, um, projects. Now I can get it closed. Okay. And the pink, um, containers I brought from Walmart. I think they were $21. So I brought two. And I might buy two more and put them on top. There's my yoga mat that I use when I'm working out. And then over here, let me move this chair so y'all can see. Um, from here, okay, those are all things that I have accumulated from the Dollar Tree. Um, in those cans are, um, beads and st um, stones and stuff like that. Um, mirrors, um, glass bling back there in the back, more stones, as you can see. Um, here is all my paints, my spray paints. And down there are more mirrors and stuff. And down there are a whole bunch of frames. And down there are some... I don't know what I'm going to do with this project yet. With those plates from the Dollar Tree. But I'll figure it out. Um, gold frames. Other little things that I have in there. And here is like candle holders and stuff like that. And here are some things I got from the Dollar Tree. Don't know what I'm going to do with them yet. But I do have an idea in my head. Um... I just added the pink curtains this morning. I used to have those in my living room. So I just added those to this morning. Um, then as you scan the room, it, you got a picture there, a lamp, my trifold, um, my couch that I painted pink. It was blue. And then pink curtains over here. Okay. And I have a whole table from my living room um, where I have the ottoman at now. I have that there. Then I have two chairs. I was going to make them into a bench, but I changed my mind and just put them in here and found my chair covers. And now I got a steam nose so that, um, you know, they look pretty, you know, unwrinkled, <laughs> whatever you want to call it. So on the table, I don't have much on that table. And then we scan over here to my office. Let me step back a little bit. This is my in-home office. I do not plan on going back to an office to work. I will be working from home. Right now, you see that big table there because I haven't found a desk that I want yet. But right now, I just installed my um, monitor. I've had it, but it was on a on this stand that's on the table right here. And so I wanted to, um, you know, give it a different look so that I could put things above it at the top or whatever have you. Um, my printer, I found these um, file cabinets at the Goodwill for $5 a piece. Um, my monitor, I think I paid $15 from uh, Bath and Body. They were getting rid of their cash, cashier um, screens. And this was for $15. And I just mounted it to the wall. And you can swivel it or whatever have you. It also has, um, let me see if I can get it to come out. It can go that way. Okay. And let's see if I can get it. This thing is in the way. Hold on, y'all. Uh, my arm comes out. 
Let me see if y'all can see the difference, how I can get that to come out. Yeah, my laptop is set up there. Uh, yeah, and it swivels, which is kind of cool. Okay. And yeah, so that's a little bit of an update right now. I don't have much. I'll make sure I got my heater under there because it'd be cold in here. And then over here, a little makeshift garbage can. And then over here, I have my big old mirror that I blinged out. Um, let me show that to you guys. So when I do my selfies or start doing outfit of the days or something like that, I can do them in this mirror and in this room because there's a lot of light. So that's just something I wanted to share with you guys real quick. Um, hope you enjoyed the tour of my makeshift gym, <laughs> craft room, and office, home office, okay? Yep, this is where I can do my Instagram stuff and do my YouTube stuff. This is where I edit and everything else. So, yeah, I just wanted to share that with you guys today. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was just a quick little update of what I was doing to the room. Like you saw the picture before where it was a mess. And then I wanted to share that with you what I've done so far. Um, I have plenty of room open here, you know, to pull my table out and do my crafts. So, um, yeah, so if you're thinking about this, hopefully this can give you some ideas or inspire you to um, do something. If you have a spare bedroom and you don't want to make it into a guest room, uh, whatever, because I don't plan on it. But when my grandkids come, I can let out the air mattresses and they can still sleep in here, um, whatever, because I don't want to make anything permanent because your girl trying to figure out how to travel this year. So, yeah, um, so that means I won't be having many visitors here in my apartment. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Hope I left you some inspiration to do some um, home projects in your own space or apartment. So I will talk to y'all in the next video. Love y'all. Bye.